guys welcome back to my channel welcome back if you're new to my channel my name is Wangoi and my content revolves around homemaking that's cooking cleaning organizing decorating I also do lifestyle vlogs and today's vlog is one of the lifestyle vlogs yeah so if you're new here please make sure you subscribe uh, make sure you leave me a comment like this video if you enjoy it and make sure your post notifications are turned on so that every time I have a new video Video, you are among my first subscribers to get a notification so now today's vlog is going to be a maintenance vlog I am going to get my hair done my nails done I have a facial later the first facial in my whole 29 years of life oh my god what's happening <laughs> yeah I'm gonna get my first facial today and I'm going to bring you guys along my maintenance day so I'll bring you guys along where I'll get my nails done they are not so bad they are not so bad um, uh, but the thumb just decided to give up I was cleaning over the weekend and it just broke but the rest of my nails are okay they are good and these are my natural nails by the way I do acrylic overlays on my natural nails so I'm going to get this fixed I'm also going to get a pedicure because Lord Jesus we are struggling <laughs> <laughs> yeah and also get this hair out i was going to undo it yesterday but i was just like mm -mm, mm -mm, i don't have the time for that i was too tired yesterday i had posted a vlog and i had been editing the whole day i still had some other work to do so i didn't get time to undo my hair but these are twists they should be undone in like 10 minutes at the salon so yeah so again i didn't want to have to wash my hair from home i am just done with my hair actually i'm gonna get dreadlocks i'm going to get artificial dreadlocks my best friend influenced me to get them and i've been seeing people rave about them and how they are easy to maintain so that's what i'm going to be getting yeah so i thought why not bring you guys along my maintenance day so we can just fix ourselves back to sanity and cuteness <laughs> yeah so my outfit of the day is this denim dress that i got from thou denim i'm going to show you properly at the mirror so the dress is really really cute it's short and perfect for the weather has a zip that runs from top to bottom so it's going to be easy to remove when i'm getting my facial done and then yeah so that's how it looks like so it's a long sleeved uh kind of well boyfriend type kind of dress i really like it i got it from thou denim they have nice denim stuff you can check them out so for my shoes i'm going to be wearing these ones these ones are originally from h&m but i bought them from toy market i love these flats so much because they are a little big than me so when my feet swell i can comfortably stay in them and for my bag i'm going to be carrying this one i got it from bag buddy ke i'm going to leave uh the page here you can go and check them out they have really nice high quality bags and they are thrifted so you're sure you're getting a quality handbag so it got spilled some paint but i managed to remove most of it i'm going to get hydrogen peroxide and try and remove this but it's really cute and because i'm filming it has enough space to carry um, my camera and my extra batteries and filming accessories so that should be it my appointment is at 9 a.m and it's currently 8 10 i actually need to get going because i'm going all the way to Roisambu. so that should be okay because i'll take like 10 15 minutes to get to stage and then uh, maybe 30 minutes to Roisambu. so i need to get going i just needed to do this intro so that you know you guys will understand what we are doing today so yeah so let me pack up and leave i will talk to you guys when i get to my nail parlor to be i have a plug for you if you're looking for high quality baby items baginebaby.ke is a thrift shop on instagram that sells high quality baby items that is blankets hats socks 
mittens shorts rompers whatever your baby might need if you're looking for a page where you can run to to get thrifted baby items i highly recommend you check out baggainbaby.ke let's give them a follow and make sure we shop from them especially if we're looking for quality items to gift a new mom baggainbaby.ke is your plug for thrifted baby clothes and other items I just got uh, done at the salon uh, at the nail parlor and these are the nails I've gotten so these are the nails I've gotten I wanted a nude brown with a little gold and they came out perfectly so really really cute thank you to Thierry nails and wig parlor I love them so I'm in an uber now heading to the salon I am so late it's already 2 p.m. and my appointment was at like 1 uh, but we're gonna make it I have my ice cream here I've gotten some ice cream so yeah I hope I'll be there at least in the next 30 minutes so that I can get my hair done I might have to push my facial to another day and if I do then I'll continue with this vlog then but I'll try and see if I'll be done with hair early if not I'll just have to go back for a facial maybe on Friday or maybe just another day but not today so yeah i'm really tired already so hungry but there's no time to grab something to eat so i've just gotten some ice cream uh here at trm i wanted to go to Kafo and get some food but i didn't know it was i, I thought it was gonna take a lot of time so i thought maybe let me just get some ice cream munch on it as i head on to the salon yeah <sighs> I'm out of breath. <laughs> so hot. Uh, this is not my vibe. This is not my vibe. Just running around is not my vibe. And who said maintenance day is actually pampering? Because it's a lot of work. I've been sitting for like three, four hours getting my nails done. But they look cute. The toes are so cute. I'll show you when I get home. But for now, I'm going to have my ice cream and then head on to the salon. Hopefully, I'm there early and I can get my locks done. So yeah, let's go. Seat. 
Yesterday took me on a ride to be honest. I um, left the salon when it was pretty late. I was with my best friend, you just saw her in uh, the clips that I rolled out before this. Yeah, so we took quite some time at the salon. So we left like at six, then you know, town and madness and traffic and all of that. We went shopping and then I came home. By the time I was getting here, I was like a D for done. I am done, I'm tired. I just, I didn't even eat. I just got home, showered and went straight to bed. So yeah, so I wanted to show you guys how my hair turned out. This is how it looks like. Mm -hmm. Let's see the other side. I don't know if it's clear to give the light, but I think it's clear, right? Yeah, so that's how it turned out. So I wanted locks. I wanted artificial locks. Okay, let me let me tell you nicely so that we understand what's happening. So I got artificial locks in the color number one mid back length and they are sparse on my head i didn't want like tiny ones because one i didn't want to strain my hair by having like small sections of my hair partitioned i just wanted like big chunky ones not really big like a medium size again i wanted them to be uh small enough for me to hold a bun by myself without needing you know someone to help me hold it up so that i'm able to maintain them for quite some time my intention is to have them for at least four months at least four months and then yeah so i'll just be going monthly to get a retie or a retouch i'll just be going monthly to get a retie and of course a wash but uh everything is fine it looks nice i love it it's so light it's just like i don't have anything on my head so yeah so the small bun is the vibe i'm going for i didn't want like the big ones because even doing that is just a lot it's a lot and also i can just like let them down and i can style them in different ways and not feel like i have a lot of hair on my head so yeah so i love them love 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 them they are not painful surprisingly i was waiting for it to be really really painful but the braids i had on before these ones were painful than this yeah so they are not painful i'm not my hairline specifically is not strained at all it's super comfortable yeah I, I don't feel pain and i think maybe even the products they applied on me really helped let me actually show you the ones they used on me because i had to buy just to make sure i have uh, the right aftercare products let me show you so here are the products uh, they recommended i get so this is called let's start with this one it's called the gas b the Gatsby Care Treatment Hair Cream. It's an anti-dandruff. As you can see, it's an anti-dandruff. And it comes in a white creamy texture. I love the scent. I love, love, love the scent. It's fresh, a bit minty. I love it. And it's so cooling on the scalp. So the advice that I apply this maybe a few times a week on my scalp just to make sure I don't get uh, dandruff. And then on the locks, I need to apply this one. This is the Styling Dreads Moisture Splash. Uh, it has a nice scent too. Yeah, it has a nice uh soft uh scent i don't mind it it's nice and it's super super big this was 700 bob and this was 500 bob so this should last me actually the whole four months because they are quite huge yeah so those are the aftercare products i got so for installation because you're about to ask me how much it costed me 
so where i went to get the locks done i leave uh the tag here on their of their instagram page you can go and see uh their page so where i got them done uh they have like a specific price for each length of locks you get regardless of the amount or the number of locks you get so for me since i didn't want many of them i didn't get a discount on that uh, so if i wanted like uh i think they are 80 yeah he told me the total number is usually 80 but i'm sure mine are not 80 i didn't i didn't use everything to be honest i wanted the shoulder length ones because that's what my cousin or best friend has but i realized they wouldn't make a nice bun like this one because they would be shorter so the band would be like really tiny so I opted to go with the mid back length which is now this it costed me 7700 full installation they undid my hair they washed my hair blow dried did the matutas and then the installation and also the aftercare like the moisturizing and everything so that costed me 7700 if i got more locks it would have still been the same because i think the price is determined by the installation process i guess not really the number of locks so yeah so that's how much i paid for it and then for the products uh the anti-dandruff was 500 and the spray was 700 so the math i don't know you guys know i don't know how to do math so just calculate that so that's what i paid there i love the style so far i really love it i am not explorative when it comes to my hair and there are just certain styles i can't do i'm just simple with my hair actually i just started like braiding my hair recently i've always done my hair at home i've kept it natural for over five years but i was just i'm getting busier i have so much to i have a lot of work to do i don't have time to keep styling my hair daily so i wanted somewhat of a semi-permanent style to just worry about once a month and the rest of the time is just spraying and styling and i love this i love this i love this so if you're looking to have some locks installed i'd highly recommend the guy he's called dan and he's so nice he's so sweet he's he's very welcoming and fun loving he's just a nice guy and he has a really big team oh my god he has a really big team so you're sure to get an appointment when you need one so yeah so that's my hair now i don't know if i showed you the nails properly here are my nails they are a bright brown or i'll say maybe a soft brown i don't know what color this is but that's how they look like so these are actually my natural nails and uh acrylic overlays so yeah they are really 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 cute i had one broken one this one so it had to get some extensions but the others are all my nails really really cute i love them so i went to theory nails uh and wigs pala oh my god that, that space is just so cute and you guys know i love cute spaces it was just so cute and the guys that did my nail that is njunge and thomas were really kind and heartwarming and nice and i love i love people who are you know they have that aura of yeah you're welcome what do you want what do you like i love the big girl treatment <laughs> and i love let me tell you guys i love doing my nails i love having my nails done by guys that's that's just it i i just love my nails being done by guys they they are more accommodating i guess and they are more easier to talk to you know regarding styles and you know the vibe we're going for and they're engaging i feel like they're engaging so me i love having my nails done by guys and yeah i got uh Njunge for my hands and uh thomas for my toes they were so kind uh they took quite some time but but I think that's the whole point of having a pedicure and a manicure like just take your time and enjoy this service yeah I should have told them I was I had another appointment or maybe I should have gone way earlier so that I didn't have to rush through it but they didn't actually rush through it 
at some point i was just like you know what we are here let's just get this done yeah so i love the service there and uh i loved uh the customer service and then the space is super 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 clean super clean once you enter the store they take your shoes and put them in a shelf they take your bag and put it away and then there are no shoes inside uh the parlor which is nice it's nice it's a very clean tidy space and my nails turned out the way i wanted them for my pedicure i got the glow pedicure and i'm telling you my legs were glowing <laughs> they were glowing i got a turmeric scrub and the guy was really gentle and yeah so as usual i'm going to leave all these details in the description box you can check out Terry's nails parlor and you can check out danielle's locks and yeah so now talking about now let me tell you guys the day just flew by i didn't get to my facial appointment which was at 4 p.m at that time i was still at the salon so i had to reschedule that i actually haven't made another appointment maybe i'll go tomorrow or monday but i have to do it in this vlog so that we can have a full maintenance vlog yeah so i'm going to get my facial done and once i do i will definitely bring you guys along yeah so i wanted to give you at least some updates with my hair and my nails so yeah so i'll pick this up when i have a facial appointment and we can and go see how that turns out. many many days later i am now going to get my facial today is tuesday and i think i last spoke to you guys last week on thursday yeah so this is where we continue with the maintenance vlog so i'm going all the way to westlands to thrive beauty spa i'm going to bring you guys along so that we can experience my first ever facial with you guys and we can see how it turns out to be i know the results don't show immediately but in a few days we should be able to see some glow <laughs> yeah so i'm going to get my facial so my skin is not problematic at the moment but i know it's usually sensitive and it's combination oily so we will see what happens to it so i'm ready to leave i have this black shift dress because the heat my goodness i need to be in airy clothes so i have this i got it from nguo kenya and i'm carrying this bag i'm carrying this bag that i got from bag store 254 it's a nice size to carry all my essentials and it has enough space for me to pack the camera so yeah so that's it for my shoes i'm wearing some brown flats i got from toy market and that's it yeah so i'm ready to leave i just needed to you know talk to you guys before i leave so that we can kind of catch up and see where we left off yeah but that's the plan it's currently 10 30 and my appointment is at 12 30 so i have two hours to you know get there so i'm not worried about being late i hope i get there early because i need to uh pass by go to home collections after my uh, my facial so that i can collect some stuff that i got from them yeah and then i also need to go to carrefour and shop for the month uh, i usually shop at nivas or quick mart that is near me but today since i will be around a place where there is a carrefour i'm going to shop from there because there are specific things i need to buy that i can't find in the other supermarkets especially laundry stuff yeah so yeah after my facial i'm going to go collect my stuff at go to home collections and then i'll go to carrefour shop for the month and then come back home i'll bring you guys along the entire day as much as that is not part of my maintenance vlog it might as well just join us and yeah it's actually maintenance because you know i'm maintaining my house <laughs> yeah so let's go i will talk to you guys at the spa
it's not going to heal too bad with one stone. Okay, okay. So I'm going to use a charcoal mask, mm -hmm. but I mix it with a brightening mask. Okay, yeah. okay. So I want to use, mm -hmm. um, I don't want to start with this brand. Okay. These are this. Yeah. The concentration of the age is here. Yeah. A bit high, high? Yes. okay. And this is the first time I'm doing your face. Mm. I would want to start with something a bit mild, okay. If I start here, mm. I'll start with the range of sensitive, yeah. That's option one, yeah. Option two, mm. I can do this one. Mm -hmm. This is this is from Spain, mm -hmm. this is from US, okay. Yes, this is where I get the cocktail, okay. Yeah, but that's where you do the Let's cocktail. lie down, okay. I look at your face further, okay. And I'll be able to decide whether it's the sensitive line mm -hmm. or mm. brightening mm. at the same time, okay. Tackling acne. Okay. Okay, sawa sawa. While steaming, okay. and then we put the concentrate okay. into treatment okay. to tackle dark circles. Mm -hmm. Then once we are done, mm -hmm. we put the mask. Okay. And then after the mask, we remove it. Mm -hmm. We put the eye cream. Okay. And then you're done. And that's and it. It has a concentration of collagen. Okay. Yes, and this concentration of menthol. Okay. And collagen as well. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I for me once, for me twice. When you're hiding things, might as well be lies. Can you? I'm outside, wait about a curve Too upset to drive you, get no money
so i'm back home and i want to quickly show you what i got uh for my haul i went to carrefour and i bought a few things well not a few but i did like a monthly restock so i'll quickly show you that so i got some velvex uh, kitchen rolls i love these ones because they are thicker and i love to use them on my kitchen counters and then i got star soft i love cuddles but i couldn't find it so i just bought this one then i got some liquid uh detergent parcel for my black clothes i have a powder one uh so i uh, i use this for my black clothes until i exhaust that i was told that liquid detergent is better than powdered one so i just bought a small one for my black ones and then and some disinfectant for my floors toilet cleaner i got a shower gel i've used this before and i love it so i had to add to that my usual morning fresh dish liquid and then i got abc blue for my whites i saw this hack from francisca shali she mentioned that she bought this for her whites to use in the machine so i had to get one pack it's so big it's a lot so i know it will last me a while and then i got oxyactive this is actually why i went to carrefour because i couldn't find this product anywhere it's like a stain remover to use in the machine so i had to get that then i got my usual wipes the usual water wipes and um regular wipes which are both unscented and zero alcohol i keep this in the bathroom and i think that brings us to the end of our toiletry section and then moving on to the food as usual when i go to carrefour i have to get myself a black forest cake i got a pear because my moods just want cake and then i got some mandazi this is coconut and lemon and then i got some natural yogurt because there's a recipe i want to do tomorrow and it needs me to use that i got some bell peppers carrots this is coconut cream in individual packs some garlic some uh cucumber i'm going to do a salad tomorrow so i had to get a cucumber and then these are tomatoes and these are dania and then moving on i have three packs of milk i usually get the daima whole milk for my milk tea then some snacks these are the afro popcorn salted butter i love this so much and some crisps i already had one pack in the car coming home and then uh, some juice pick and peel pineapple and pick and peel tropical mix those are my two favorite ones then some salt and then this is some lemons also for the recipe i'm going to be doing tomorrow some onions and then some capsicum i think these are the green ones no these are the red ones i have two red ones and two green ones then i got some beef some chicken quarters and uh these are some chicken wings actually these are the ones i'm going to be using for my recipe and then some chicken quarters and last but not least some toilet paper i got the soft leaf one because it was much more affordable than the other brands but that's basically it so that's my usual haul oh i didn't show you my cooking oil this is the three liter rina uh yeah i usually get this and it will last me quite a long time because i don't um Make fried foods with it so yeah so that's it so yeah that's my haul this should last me at least the month uh, of march maybe I, I i'll definitely buy the fresh foods i know they won't last more than two weeks but everything else should last me a while i didn't buy a lot of food uh stuff like the rice and spaghetti i still have a lot of that because i haven't been cooking a lot so this should last so I quickly wanted to show you guys a package. Here we go. I got the Philips air fryer for a campaign I'm doing with Jumia, Jumia X Philips. So we are doing a campaign in the month of March and I am going to be using this to make a few recipes to share on my Instagram page. So if you would love to see the recipes I create, please make sure you follow me on Instagram and we can see what I create. But yeah, it's so cute. I can always to unbox it but i already know it's such a nice appliance to have so if you're looking for an air fryer that will last you ages i highly recommend you get a philips one i've interacted with a philips air fryer before and i'm telling you it's everything it says it is so yeah so i'm going to do that um 
tomorrow and post the reel so please make sure you follow me on instagram so that you see the recipe i come up with but yeah that's basically it so i passed by go to home collections and i wanted to show you guys what i got from them so go to home usually stock grifted carpets pillowcases bed sheets both fitted and uh the banded ones what are they we are both fitted and flat sheets um carpets mats bathroom mats duvets duvet covers everything soft furnishings for your home they have those but they are all thrifted so i got a duvet cover in this lovely top color i thought it was gonna be beige but it's top but i think the inside the, the other side of it because it's double sided is beige so the other side is beige but the top is top I love <laughs> the top is top <laughs> I love the color I'm leaning towards warmer and softer colors so I'm loving this definitely this is a 7 by 7 it will fit my duvet perfectly and it will go with the theme I'm trying to achieve for my bedroom and also just to break the usual whites that I have so yeah I got this from them just passed by and collected it and I so much love it love it and then I got a set of bathroom mats this is so cute again in my lovely neutral colors this is like cream and beige and top and it comes as a set it has the full mat and the toilet mat as well so it comes in the toilet mat and the other mat for the sink area so yeah i love them so so much they are so cute and then i got this one which is a white set i am gambling having white bath mats but now that i have the machine i should be able to i should be able to manage this and maintain them white so there we go again a toilet mat and the sink area mat that's another set i have another set i have another set another white set i got two white sets by the way which i love so it has of course the toilet mat and the usual long mat i can't wait to clean these actually i'll clean them tomorrow and then use them then last but not least i got the uh the what do they call them the towel mats yeah i got the towel mats for using to step on when i get out of the shower so really really nice i love them i love them they are in nice colors again top and beige this will go so well actually my bath uh my hand towels are in this color so it should match that yeah and then when i'm using that top um that top bath mat i can be using this one so love love that love that love that so yeah so that's basically it it's been a long day guys it's been a long day but before i end it let me sit down and share with you how my facial went and just give you you know a little more info on it so that if you're looking to have yours then you can go and get yours done here we are i am up close and personal so that you can see my glowing face oh my god oh my god i'm so happy so happy i feel so good my skin feels like and supple and moisturized all those good things so yeah so i went to thrive beauty spa it's in westlands woodville grove and it's just it's in jim Khan house quite convenient i didn't even get lost looking for it i am the queen of getting lost because i never leave the house but i didn't get lost so yeah so maureen of uh, thrive beauty spa was so kind and heartwarming she's so sweet so so sweet and she took me through the entire process to explain everything that was going on as you've seen in the clips that i have just shared the facial that was a basic facial but she did something she called that moment when i had uh algos on my skin was the high frequency treatment which is meant to kind of improve my blood circulation and just you know like awaken my veins around my skin and yeah it was a little tingly not tingly not even painful it's like just packs it was packs actually and yeah that was it so i really really enjoyed my facial the only part that was very painful 
and I knew I was gonna feel pain was the extraction because my nose and my chin are super oily so I got quite a lot of you know gunk out of that as you saw in the clips but yeah it was painful I teared up a bit but I knew it was gonna come and I was prepared for it mentally but it was very important because I got rid of a lot of whiteheads and blackheads and stuff like that yeah so yeah if you wanna go get a facial you can book with them i'll leave their instagram tag here or you can check the link in the description box you can go and get your facial now they don't just do facials they do a lot of many other treatments they do massages they do their they do nails they do waxing they do eyebrow threading they do body scrubs whatever treatment you want on your body i bet they have it but please check their instagram page go and see the services they have to offer but you can get basically anything that you want to be done on your on your body and even for facials they have different facial facials today i did the basic facial but they have like chemical peels they have hydra facials those complex ones that i am yet to understand they have all those types of facials so you can go and check them out that was my experience and that brings us to the end of my maintenance vlog which has been running for days but i really wanted to bring you guys along and plug you guys on the places where i'm getting my nice nice services and my nice nice pampering so that i don't leave you guys behind yeah so my nails are still looking cute a week later actually it's almost a week later i love them i love um my hair is still it's already starting to grow old but the older it gets the better it looks please check out all the places that i have tagged and check their links in the description box so that if you're looking for all these services you can go and get them if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comment section and i will answer you until next time bye